Hello Aquarius and welcome to your June 2019 future love reading. Let's see what's going on with your future love. Yeah, I'm reading this in uh, June 2019, but time is fluid, right? So this could be happening right now. This could be happening in a few months from now, whatever the case may be. But let's take a peek and see what's going on with your future love. This is for Aquarius. What is going on with their future love, Aquarius? What is going on with their future love? What is going on with their future love? We have past life relationship. You have known each other before. So your souls are connected, okay? This is somebody that you're very familiar with, somebody that you have soul ties to, somebody that you've shared lives with, and that's why they're in your life right now. Now, healing family issues, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. There could be some family drama going on with this person. Uh, could be going on with you. Um, you guys could be having some family drama together. Um, but we're trying to heal that. We're trying to figure this out. Okay, so let's see what is going on here with Aquarius. With Aquarius. For their future love reading for June 2019. If this resonates with you, Aquarius, please like, share, and subscribe and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you at all, Aquarius, please do check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign as this will not resonate with every Aquarius out there. Please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable, so however it resonates with you. This is for Aquarius for June 2019. What's going on with their future love? What is going on with their future love? Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, so you're on defense against this person. Maybe you, you're blocked them emotionally for sure because I see two cards of that right now. All right, they've got a lot of regrets here when it comes to the situation. They want to heal this situation. Um, the connection is very strong here between the two of you, of course. But something went down here and whatever it is, they regret it. But you are on defense against this person, okay? That's what this Seven of Wands is all about. This is Fire, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. You're on defense. And they know that. You've blocked them emotionally. They are completely and totally aware of that. They want to heal it. Um, I've got Fire, Air, Water, Earth. Everybody's here. So I'm going to read the energies of the cards. If the sign of the person that you are dealing with have dealt with, right, or be dealing with in the future, time is fluid, okay? Um, and keep in mind, uh, some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. But if the sign of the person that you are dealing with, <clears throat> if it pops up, then all the better. Right now you're on defense, Aquarius, and that's fine, okay, because something went down here that needs to be healed, and this person has a lot of regrets. They're focused very much on past things, and maybe you are too. Um, there's a lot of sadness here, a lot of depression. We have the Five of Cups. This is Water Energy, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. So a lot of regrets about how things went down between the two of you. Um how they feel towards you they're seeing you as blocked emotionally so they know that they're going to have to get serious and work on this okay um you need more time maybe more information to make any kind of decisions because you have blocked them and just look at here there was a lot of pain here a lot of hurt could have been a big betrayal here between you and this person but like i said you've shared past lives together your souls are connected um and that could be, a, this could be a real big learning experience for this person and you as well, okay? Maybe they're realizing the connection here, but there was a lot of pain and hurt. Some drama most definitely went down. 
Okay, somebody got hurt here. And I do believe it was you because they're seeing you as on defense, blocking your heart, guarded with your heart, guarded with your heart, right? So you're going to, they know you're going to need time to think about this. This is how they're seeing you. Very closed off emotionally to them. Okay, the challenge is this King of Pentacles energy right here. I feel like <clears throat> the challenge is, are we going to get serious about this? Okay, because this is a very serious energy. This is long-term commitments. This is long-term offers. Um, this is Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, and this is the kind of energy, male or female, that is able to deliver serious offers. Okay, loyalty, protection, longevity here. Um, so, yeah. You could be dealing with a person that you work with. You could be dealing with somebody in finance or uh, works uh, like with land, with farming, um, anything with finances, land, um, real estate, that kind of thing, right? Banking. But anyway, as an energy, this person needs to kind of step up to the plate and maybe that is the challenge. Maybe that's why shit went down here. Um, so serious commitments, that's what we're looking for. What are they going to do? What are they going to do? Knight of Cups. This is a proposal. So this is an offer of emotion to you. This could be in the form of an apology, some sort of emotional offer here. Um, I miss you. Um, let's try again. Extending that olive branch, showing emotion here. Okay. Knight of Cups, this is more water energy here. All right, so what's going to happen here, Aquarius, is this temperance card. So this is reconnecting. This is reconciling. This is healing the situation. So they know that they have um, their work cut out for them. They know that it's going to be a challenge here. But I see things balancing out between the two of you. And I do see things, um, emotions start flowing here. And I do see... Um, a reconnection here and a lot of patience and a lot of kindness here too, Aquarius so let's clarify this this is Sagittarius energy by the way let's clarify that temperance card let's clarify that temperance card for Aquarius what is going on here with Aquarius what is going on here with Aquarius what is going on here with Aquarius's future love? Please clarify the temperance card. Yeah, and we're going to be moving forward here. We're going to be moving forward. We're going to put the past behind us. There's going to be movement here. Okay, this person could live at a distance from you as well. Six of Swords, this is more air energy. And again with this, again with this um, defensiveness. So let's see I'm gonna pull one more card so there's definitely going to be movement here towards a more peaceful situation this is for Aquarius one more card for Aquarius please yeah and it I don't think this person is able to let go of the situation so they're gonna come in and try again um, maybe they've tried to let go and it simply did not work but I feel like um, ten of wands here I think it's just an ending to these old burdens. I think this is an ending to the drama, and I think we're going to be moving moving ahead towards a better place. They can't let go of the situation with you anyway. Here you are at the bottom of the deck. You're really going to make them work for it, Aquarius, okay? Because you're coming through as the King of Swords, and this is a very hardcore energy. Um, so, yeah, they got their work cut out for them that is for sure you're thinking with your head now okay and not your heart you're going to need some serious clarity here this is a very hardcore energy you ain't you are not playing you are not playing they're going to have to prove it they're going to have to prove it aquarius that is for damn sure all right that is your june 2019 future love reading i hope it resonates i um I'm getting ready to go on the road trip, as most of you know. So next week, I'm not going to be getting out um, the weekly readings. 
the July monthly readings will be the following week. It will be in July, and um, I usually like to do those before um, the um, beginning of the month, but this time, you know, what can I say? I'm going to finish up these future love readings and get out as many uh, daily readings as I can, and I may take my cards with me and pop on. I don't know. I'm just going to play it by ear. Um, what else? I'm going to keep you guys uh, posted on our adventures and um, we'll see what happens. I'm very excited, but I just wanted to let you guys know what's going on. So next week you're going to be hearing very little from me, <laughs> but the beginning of July we'll be back at it. All right, Aquarius, you have a great week and you take very good care of yourself. All right. Very interesting reading here. Okay. So I will talk to you. I think my last live show is tomorrow. Okay. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. And you guys take good care. Have a great um, week. And God bless.